Question 8. The tables shows... A bit of a grammatical error up there. So the table shows the sales of food and drink for three days at a small coffee shop. Okay, so we've got the day, we've got the sales of food and sales of drink separately. Chris uses the, this information to draw a bar chart. And then says, write down three different mistakes that he has made. So, we're looking for things that he's not done correctly. Well, the first thing I notice is there is no label here. What is this telling me? Is it telling me the number of elephants or, you know, something random? I don't know. It should actually be telling me the amount in pounds, okay? So my first mistake, there is no label on the y-axis. Okay, so it's not very clear. Right, next thing I'm noticing, there's two bars for each day. Well, how do I know which is which? Which of these is going to be the sale of food and which of them is going to be the sale of drink? He needs to write a key. So that's my next mistake. There's no key for the bars. Okay, and then let's just look carefully at these bars. That you know, we might find another mistake there. So on Monday, the sale of food was 35 and the sale of drinks was 15. So I, partly because I don't know what the labels are, I'm going to assume that this was food and this one was drink. Okay, so 35 is where this should, be, this first one should be at. Well, that's not at 35. It's more like 37. Okay, so that must be my next mistake. This here is at 15, which is what that one's at. Okay, if I look at these, these are both 27, and yeah, they both look like they're about 27. And then this last two should be 47 and 36. Again, that looks like it's around about 47 and 36. Yeah, I would say that is about 36. So this is my mistake, or Chris's mistake even. So, sales of food on Monday is not plotted correctly. 